Greetings, listeners. How's everything in your part of the world? So I have a question for you today for foodies. Have you ever made homemade lasagna? How did it turn out the first time you made it? How about Stouffer's signature lasagna? Here's a quick story. In January, when I moved to New York City from a small town in Ohio, I um, took up residence at, um, it was for women. It was, uh, it was called the YMCA, Do, you know, that, don't ask me why. It wasn't the YW, you know, for women. Anyway, it was on 38th Street within walking distance of Grand Central Station. Across the street was a Stouffer's restaurant. I remember it because I just uh, put a frozen Stouffer's signature lasagna into my oven. And I'm not, the memories are just flooding my head. Why? I had their lasagna. Today, I'm not sure if I'm in New York, Ohio, or Italy, but be that as it may, on a cold winter snowy day like today, I'm thinking about lasagna, maybe a little Chianti. So that's my broadcast today in my part of the world that's very quiet. I'm watching the birds at the bird feeder. Just speaking for myself in my part of the world, which is cold and snowy, not that cold, maybe in the 30s. Italian food, pasta, lasagna, as you can see in this video, is the best way to chase away the blues. Don't forget the garlic bread. Any kind of white bread will do, but make sure that you, there is always Spice World minced garlic on hand in your refrigerator at all times and grated Parmesan cheese, especially during the cold winter snowy months. Chase away the blues with a lasagna, either by Stouffer's or made with your own two hands. Thank you for listening.